guys, my name is Alicia and welcome to a day in my life as an SMU student. I'm Indonesian and I'm a student at SMU. I'm also a content creator on TikTok and YouTube and I make aesthetic lifestyle vlogs or lifestyle vlogs in general. So you probably came to this video because you're wondering what an SMU student usually does on a day-to-day -day basis. So that's why I'll be showing you guys. To those who don't live in Singapore or haven't heard of SMU before, SMU is a public research university that specializes in business. However, unlike most unis that have a lot of faculties, SMU only has six. And also just a note to take before I start this video, obviously this video is not representative of all SMU students, it is just based on my personal experience and what I normally do on a day-to-day -day basis. And even then, what I do as a student in SMU varies depending on whether it's project week, midterms week, or if there's anything else. Walking from the Dobigot MRT and it's about a 5 minute walk away from the SMU School of Social Sciences campus which is also the same building as the School of Economics. So I'm going to chill in a study room before my class starts. Here are the group study rooms and basically we can book them to have meetings or self-study sessions. I'm just here to finish up some readings real quick. Now going to head out to buy lunch and I really like the view here. Buying pasta from the tea party and during peak hours it's usually very crowded here. This is a seminar room where we have our classes and unlike most unis that have giant lecture halls, we have classes and smaller groups in the seminar rooms. For one module, there is one class a week and each class lasts for 3 hours with a 15 minute break in between. But some modules are split into 2 classes a week, each lasting for 1.5 hours. So most students just take their notes on their laptop while the prof is teaching, but personally, I find that an iPad is so useful for lectures. showing y'all the SMU Lee Cushing Library, but we usually just call it LKS for short. Yeah, I'm living this life with a different attitude. Don't flip, don't trip, keeping up the good mood. Cooking up some good food with my friends in the street. Yeah, people want to chill, they can come and speak to me. This area is usually quite crowded with students, and right across here is the School of Accountancy. This is one of my favorite areas in the school just because it looks so nature y. This connects to the School of Law and the Kwa Gok Chu Law Library. I often go to the KGC Library to study. It's also often very crowded here, yet very, very silent. You can literally hear a pin drop if you're studying here. Hey guys, so I'm currently in the SMU project room and today I'm doing my work here. Usually SMU students come to these project rooms to have their group meetings or if they just want a more personal space to do their homework, their readings or whatever. This giant black building is called the SMU Connection and this is the School of Accountancy. 
come and speak to me cause Cause all you gotta do is just ask Cause we can always get another glass Got drip, got swag, got class Just roll another one then puff puff pass Cause these times won't last so don't let them pass Don't let them run away they as fast as the day come Yeah, they as fast as vacation Hey guys, I'm home from school and now I am going to clean. I live alone in Singapore so I do spend a lot of time cleaning and doing chores. Which is an absolute headache because when you're just so busy, you don't have time to do chores. And also, as I'm editing this video right now, I realized that what I do in a day doesn't seem very exciting. I realize it's mostly just studying, being in school, going to project meetings, and um, doing readings. But, you know, I feel like that's the reality of it. That's what I normally do. But I guess before COVID happened, the student life in SMU was definitely more exciting. There were always like a lot of events and like booths happening around school. And we were allowed to hang out in, well, big groups back then. So it was definitely more lively before. So normally after classes, SMU students would also go and join their CCA so for example if they're in a track and field team then they would go and have training or but that has toned down a bit because of COVID-19 and also because I'm in year four I don't join any CCAs anymore So usually at night, after I'm done eating dinner, showering and everything, I try to do some of my readings and catch up before my next class the next morning. So I'm wearing the SMU t-shirt. This is the SSU shirt, which is the SMU Sports Union shirt. I have a bunch of SMU clothes from like events and they make really good home t-shirts and um, pajamas. time now when I'm about to sleep. I actually consider myself more as a night person than a morning person and I tend to have a pretty late sleeping time so I think I usually sleep at like 1 or 2 a.m. So thank you so much guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it so don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. If you guys have any more ideas or suggestions or what kind of day in my life videos you want to see as an SME student then do let me know in the comments below because I'll definitely be vlogging more especially when a new school semester starts in August. I am also active on TikTok and Instagram so do check me out there as well.